Dance Circle project? Well, first of all, it's two things. One is the actual writing project. The whole thing is entitled The Dance Circle Project. And that is a 10-book serialized e-project developed by Eileen Bell and myself, Ryan McFadden. Um, and we've also brought on board some other writers who have worked with us in the past. Uh, between the four of us, we've won five Aurora's countless publishing credits. Um, <clears throat> in the fictionalized world, the Tent Circle Project is a mysterious project that both cities right now are basically touting as a way of free energy. But of course, there's much more to that. In each, each book that goes along, we're going to find out a little bit more of what's really down there. It's a, right now, it's a geothermal dig, is how they're framing it. But of course, there's a history to this Tent Circle Project. And the cities are hoping this will bring them together, but in fact, it's probably going to rip the cities apart. The stories take place in two twin cities nestled somewhere in North America that are called Hope and Glory, twin cities that are separated by a bridge and a chasm that's pretty much impassable. Um, and while these two cities share much, they, are, they share, also share a very, very bloody history. Um, hope, think of really, think of San Francisco and Oakland, and hope being Oakland, and glory being San Francisco. My story in the first circle is called One Small Job. Now it's the, it's the featured novella of the first circle. Now each, each circle, there's going to be ten of them, has one featured novella, a novella being pretty much half of what you would consider a novel. First one is mine, and it's called One Small Job. And it's what I'd like to consider uh, pretty much standard neo noir, science fiction, supernatural crime thriller, you know, that, that old nut. So, and my story involves a, a, a damaged man named Jack who's having a few relationship issues. And it's just one small job. All he has to do is deliver a body to a place in Yellowknife. He's with a wheelman, who's a drug addict. He's with a bomb expert, who's blown off half his face and his hand. And he's with his brother, who is the meanest son of a bitch on the planet. And of course, as these things happen to do, one small job turns into a very large job when they get, get stuck in hope and glory. 